Fitzy and Whipper. Well, we've already won a gold, a bronze, and the Winter Olympics. I'm riding. We'll take it. Yep. I mean, there was a bit of figure skating over the weekend where I thought, oh, I don't know if I can watch this for too long. But then when we start winning medals, I start I mean, getting excited. One man that you can see on Channel 7 throughout this whole broadcast is the magnificent Matt Sherman. Sherman! Sherman. Hey! Oh. How good are our Winter Olympians? Oh. Like, it, it just blows my mind. Every time the Olympics roll around, you kind of try and put your finger on why they're so great. But do you know what? It doesn't matter if you... If you paddle a canoe, yes. if you swing a tennis mm-hmm. racket, if a you broom. wear a pair of spikes, we just want to see you dominate. And you touched on there, uh, Fitzy, the bronze and, and gold. In one day, it's our most ever at wow. a game's history breaking. But Jakara Anthony, wow. Like, if, if you saw that, she dominated. She came there so ready to compete and um, the rest of the field couldn't touch her. She was just unbeatable the whole way through. And, and it was uh, it really was that focused determination we see from someone like a Kathy Freeman or mm-hmm. an Ash yeah. Barty or a Jess Fox. Shermo, <laughs> were you ever approached with your... Because, By what? Oh, mate, mate you, you had so much power in your legs. Did you ever get approached to maybe do the bobsled or just get them off to a good start? Did you ever think about doing that? You know, I, I did actually. When I uh, when wow. I wrapped up my sprinting career, um, a guy called Jeremy Rollinson, who was a driver in the four-man bobsled, who actually ended up going to the Vancouver Olympics, yeah, right. uh, approached me and said, we really need uh, a brakeman, a, a mm. guy at the back that pushes really hard. And I went to the first training session. I've got to be so honest. I went awesome. to the first training session. They were literally power squatting 300 kilos. And I just went, do you know what? I'm out. Oh, you guys, no, good luck. Go me. well. Go well. No, I can't. I can't sit in the back of a taxi without kind of throwing a few yeah. tips at the driver. Yeah. You sit yeah. back in a bobsled. You're going 125 k's an hour, like you're reading a book. Yep, with no I, control. Yeah, I couldn't do it. Couldn't um, well, there was. Yeah, we we played some vision the other night on the front bar. There was the Commonwealth of Independent States. I mean, they're not around anymore because, first of all, they're not very good. <laughs> Second of all, yeah. their four man bobsled. They all pushed <laughs> and they all went to go jump in. Second and third actually swapped places, and one guy was facing the wrong way. Oh, God. Awesome. <laughs> so he was going down the track backwards, just saying to the other guy, "Are we there yet?" Are we there yet? <laughs> <laughs> he had no idea where they were going. <laughs> well, you know what I didn't realise too. Watching some clips, Sher, though, on the ski jump, they jump over two hundred and fifty metres, flying uh, through the air. You are that is so wrong. They're they're, they're two hundred and fifty metres high. <laughs> yes. They come in. At, they come in at a hundred k's an hour, and they jump just over a hundred metres. Oh, no, 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 no. close, <laughs> close. No. He's been saying it all week. Yeah. Sure though. <laughs> sure though, that is. So the height of the tower. The height of the Is that tower, where they measure it from? Yeah. So the height of the tower is between 250 and 300 meters. You bang on there, but they fly just over 100 meters. Ski oh. jump record. Oh. Here we go. No, no. Ski but... jump record is 253.5 yeah. meters. Yeah, but so that's they not include this event. It's at, not at this an event. Olympic Games. Yeah, at an, at, a, at Olympic Games. So are you telling me the tower, the jump, is included in the record in that distance? No, no, it's not. It's the distance from the end of the in run. Yeah, you're a loser, mate. Uh, you, you 200, know, yeah. 250 k, 250 metres, it's, it's a quarter of a kilometre. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> That's on, what mate. I thought. Come on. You're kidding yourself. It's a long way. You, he's been Two, using that all 253 week. 253 metres. He's been using that all week. Thank you, Sherry. Do, you know, do you know what you should do? Tune, tune into Seven's coverage and we'll find out. Hey? <laughs> do, you know the, do you know when the ski jumping yeah. is, Shervo? Ski jumping's already started. It's underway. They also have the Nordic combined where they combine uh, the cross country and the ski jumping together. So they're, they're they? actually probably the fittest and most fearless athletes in the game. So they, do the, they still do the shooting in the cross country? No, no, that's the bias line. Oh, but you're close. Oh, you're close. Good things coming through. And what about? <laughs> Here we go. <laughs> Don't stop. Just oh, double down. Do they do any like? Is there a, like just a winter shooting sport? Is that does that exist oh. at all? Um. <laughs> I'll tune into the coverage of Channel 7. Servo wishes he had a gun right now, I think. (laughs) What I'll do is I'll tune into the coverage and then we'll go with it. I wish we were in backcountry Wyoming somewhere and I spotted that giant yak. (laughs) Mate, that is... Don't shoot, Servo. No. (laughs) This is the thing. We're learning, aren't we? As we go through the Winter Olympics, we're learning, guys. And it doesn't matter. You don't need to know all the rules. We'll help you out. Thank you. Thank you. Servo, you are here, though. You're up against Matt (laughs) Groot this morning for... Uh, headline.
Matt Shervington versus Matty DeGroote. It's a topical story. Give us your best headline. Let's do it. Well, Matt DeGroote's job is to read out headlines. Yeah. He's not that great at it, but gets it right sometimes. <laughs> Start spreading the news. I'm leaving today. <laughs> Matt Shervington is about from? to rip out his spine. Well, metaphorically, with some headlines. Let's do this. Oh. MDG, you can go first. All right, first headline today, boys, I need from you. The topical story is Australia has broken their gold medal drought with a win for Jakara Anthony yeah. in the Moguls. Best headline, Matt DeGroote. Gold for the Aussies, that medal will shine. It's a shame she'll have to sell it to buy a new spine. Oh, because oh. the moguls are really hard on your spine. Oh. Oh. Yeah, not oh. Mogul back, spine, they call that. Like, just actually break that your spine. That was Way more that courageous than you, mate. Okay, Shervo, best headline. A long-awaited gold for Australia has made the world ogle while Whippers doing the downhill media mogul. Oh, oh. Wow. yeah. Downhill yes. media mogul. Better than the downward dog. Very, Very good. <laughs> Shervo for round one. Oh, Shervo, Shervo's Shervo can go first here. Okay, second one. Aussie curlers do Australia <laughs> proud at the Winter Olympics. I don't know if they did. Aussie curlers oh. do Australia <laughs> proud oh, at bronze. the Winter Olympics. Shervo, what do you got? With broom skills, those curlers sure are dreamers. They're so good at sweeping that whippers hide them as cleaners. Hey! Make sure the first check clears. <laughs> I don't get it. I don't get it, MDG. To succeed but no one cares would leave you feeling blue, like when Fitzy talks about kicking five on debut. Oh! So career limiting for you to go. Sherbo's got that one. Sherbo. I'm confident with the third. This will be a clean sweep. I'm confident with the third. All right, Matty DeGroote, last one. Cold and chilly athletes battle with freezing temperatures at the 2022 Beijing Olympics. Your best freezing headline. Is colder than ice Tanya Harding or Sarah rejecting my romantic bombarding? Oh, <laughs> Thank you for securing an absolute oh whitewash. Shervo, just for the formality, wow. you can do yours, but you're not going to lose. It's also Tonya Let's Harding. Let's walk this one home. Yeah, I wasn't sure which one Tonya. it was. Tanya. Tanya. <laughs> Tanya. The Aussie <laughs> version. Tanya uh. Harding. All right, Shervo, <laughs> this headline. Uh. Minus 18 degrees is chilly, all right, but it's nothing compared to the cold shoulder Matt's wife gives him every night. Yeah. 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 A legitimate victory at <laughs> the slaughtering of a pig. Yeah. Wow. Yeah. <laughs> well done, Shervo. Watch the Beijing 2022 Winter Olympics live on Channel 7. Stream it for free on 7 Plus. Love you, Shervo. Thanks, mate. Love your work. Bye, Shervo. Fitzy and Whipper.